Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, please subscribe and give the video a big thumbs up. I would love to have you. Today's video is gonna be my newborn nighttime routine. I currently have a seven week old newborn named Quentin, and I also have a three year old toddler named Camden. And my newborn Quentin is actually sleeping through the night. He sleeps for about six hours straight. He gets up to nurse, and then he goes back down for another three hours. So it's been so amazing, and I wanted to help any of you mamas out there who are struggling to get their newborns to sleep and so let's just jump right into the video now I do want to throw a little disclaimer out there Alex and I are night owls we do everything pretty late we eat dinner late we go to bed late and that's just how we are right now so Quentin's nighttime routine does start a little bit later I'm not exactly sure what time it is when I'm nursing him in this clip but this is like the first nighttime feeding for him and um, I only do this one nighttime feeding and then he gets a bottle right before I put him down for his six hour stretch. Okay, so after I finish burping Quentin, well first I have to sneak those kisses in there anytime I can. <laughs> but I go ahead and I put him in his swing. He loves his swing. I'll link it down below, the exact one that we use. But I also use the same swing with my first son Camden who was just as obsessed with it as Quentin is. And anytime that I need to make dinner or eat dinner or do work or really have a moment to myself, I will put Quentin in the swing because it will just always calm him down and he loves to take naps in here too. So yeah, I highly recommend the swing. Okay, so now it's time for me to eat dinner and my husband is actually working out right now so he's gonna eat dinner when he comes back inside. But um, this is a little tip, you guys. So I have Quentin now in his Snuggle Me Organic Lounger which he also absolutely loves. I swear, he loves the swing and the lounger so much. And I try and keep him awake at this point. I want him awake for at least two hours before he goes down for the entire night. Um, sometimes even three hours. and. If he starts to nod off or get tired, I'll like pick him up and try to just play with him or do some tummy time or something like that. But as you can see, he is wide awake right now and I think that's because he's so used to his routine. Well, what do you know? Quentin spit up. <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and change him out of these clothes and also change his diaper as well. Okay, so I pump twice a day. I pump once in the morning after the morning feed and then I pump once at night after the last nighttime feed. So I already fed Quentin and now I'm gonna go ahead and pump 
and then I'm gonna give Quentin the bottle of milk that I just popped. And I've gotten a lot of questions lately on if I do like my breast pump. I have the Spectra S2, I believe it's called, and I really do love it. I used to use the Medela with Camden, um, which I loved as well, but I'm really liking the Spectra. So we just started watching the new season of Stranger Things, and you guys, it's so good. I highly recommend it. So now I'm going to change the settings on the Spectra. I do this a few times while I'm pumping, just so I get more milk out. And we also play with little Quinn, make sure that he stays awake. Daddy is just doing some tummy time on his lap with him right now. Okay, so I pump for about 20 minutes, and then I will go into the kitchen and I will make a bottle for Quentin. So I usually only pour about two ounces of my milk in the bottle and Quentin will drink all of it. And I also add these probiotic drops. This is called Gerber Soothe. I've been using this for a while now. I think since Quentin was like a week or two old. And I swear these have helped his acid reflux so much. Another thing we give Quentin before bed are his vitamin D drops, which the pediatrician recommended because I do breastfeed. And now I'm gonna go ahead and put away the rest of the milk in this breast milk storage bag. Usually I will put it in the fridge and then the next day I will fill it up with the rest of the milk that I made that morning and then I'll toss it in the freezer. Okay, so it's time to go ahead and change Quentin. This is where I will change his diaper if he needs it, but if not, I'll just go ahead and I will swaddle him. So we love to use the Velcro swaddles. Um, these are knockoffs of the Snuggle Me ones, but they're more affordable and I got them on Amazon. I will go ahead and link those down below if you guys are interested, but they work just as well. And I do not put a onesie on Quentin. Um, under the swaddle and the reason why is because our house is super super hot at night like I'm sweating Alex is hot like and I know Quentin is hot because if I pick him up I can just feel how hot he is so we just leave the onesie off of him but obviously like if your house is cooler then I would suggest to put a onesie on under the swaddle All right, so now I'm just putting Quentin down for the night and I put him in his Halo bassinet. This is the same bassinet that I used for Camden as well. And I make sure that the Wubbanub is in his mouth because he's got to sleep with the passy. It helps so much. And I love that the Wubbanubs are weighted too so they don't fall out of his mouth. So we don't have a sound machine yet for Quentin. I'm interested in getting one. Uh, let me know down below what you guys recommend. But for right now, I just use the music on the Halo bassinet. It's just super, super low. That's the only downside of it. But I also put the vibrate on because Quentin loves that as well. And as for lighting, I will dim our lights like all the way to the lowest setting. 
and this way I can just like check on Quentin whenever I want without having to like turn the light on all the way. So yeah, that is it you guys. That is everything for this newborn nighttime routine and Quentin will sleep for at least six hours. It's a miracle. Um, if you guys try this and it works for you, please let me know and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up and I will see you guys next time.